Okay, you don't want to deal with it. Okay, what about Nancy Pelosi? The first vote you have to cast when you become a member of Congress is to vote for the leader of your party that's nominated for Speaker. Who are you going to vote for for Speaker? I don't know who's going to run, but I know Pelosi's we, running for re-election. We, we need change. So. We need change on both. So sides. you're not voting for Pelosi? No. Well, how are you going to help the Democrats get the 218 they knew to win the House? You have to be one of the votes. Yeah, we, we so need So what are you going to do? If you're one of the 218, they need to take control of the House. And the, and the vote on the floor is Pelosi. What are you going to do? We need to have new leadership on both sides. So you'd vote against her even if it meant you didn't get control of the House? We need leadership on both sides. And you don't get control of the House? Well, we need to have If it's have a decisive of vote, would you vote against Pelosi? We if it's need, decisive. We need new leadership you're, you're on both sides. You know you have to decide this. Just but tell we, me you know you have to decide it. No, but we need new leadership. No, just tell me you the know. The old ways aren't working. No. You know that for the Democrats can get control, you have to have 218 members of the House Absolutely. vote for the candidate of the Democratic Party for Speaker. I would you support do that? whoever the Democratic Party Thank puts you. forward. Thank you. Danny O'Connor.